If you've recently set up private space on Android 15, then you may not be happy with the private bar sitting at the bottom of your application drawer. Some will think this default setup doesn't make it very private at all, but I can show you a simple setting that will hide it from view, while also showing you how to access your private space after we have removed this bar. Now, I will assume that you have already enabled this feature on Android 15, but if you haven't done this yet, I'll be sure to include a link to my introductory guide that I've done down in the video description below, while also including this link in the pinned comment as well, so that it is easy for everyone to hide. To begin, we first need to unlock our private space. So bring up the app drawer, scroll all the way down to the bottom, and then tap on that bar so that we can unlock it. Next, look for the gear icon that is right next to the lock button. Tap it, and that will bring up the settings area for your private space. And we can hide that bar from the app drawer by tapping on the hide private space option right here. This will bring up a toggle that will be disabled by default. We can tap it to enable it. Now when we go back and we lock our private space, you can see that the private bar is no longer visible within the application drawer. Now, once you have hidden your private space, you may be wondering how you can access it. And that part is easy as well. We're simply going to bring up the application drawer, tap on the search box up here at the top, and then begin typing out private space. You should see a populated result for private space that you can then tap on, which then asks you to unlock your private space. Once you have entered your PIN pattern or password, you'll see your private space expand right at the bottom of your application drawer, just like you're used to. Honestly, it makes sense why Google would not have this setting enabled by default. Not only would it make the feature more confusing, for those who were just wanting to test it out, but it may also condition people to forget that they even set it up to begin with. I would rather have seen this setting surfaced in a different way, since not everyone is going to tap on that icon to see what options are available here. But at least the feature is available. So let me know if you would rather have the private spacebar hidden by default, or if you're happy with how Google displays it in the application drawer. And please, do not forget to like this video while also subscribing to the channel for more Android 15 tips like this.